How to set up HMA Pro VPN Open VPN on OpenWRT router. Attention, we also have an Open VPN registered auto installer for DDWRT and OpenWRT routers. This tutorial assumes that you have OpenWRT with the Lucy WebIF web interface installed. Visit OpenWRT.org for more information. Log into the Lucy WebIF. Go to System Dash Software. Click Update Package Lists. Paste Lucy App Open into the Download and Install Package box and click OK. While still in the Lucy WebIF, go to Network Dash Interface. Type VPN in the box and click Add Entry. Protocol None. Override Interface Unchecked. Interface Ton Zero. Drop down menu then select Custom and type in Ton Zero. Create slash Assign Firewall Zone One. Download the VPN config.zip from here, http colon slash slash hidemyes.com slash vpn hyphen config slash vpn hyphen configs.zip And the certificates and key can Downloaded from here, http colon slash slash hidemyes.com slash vpn hyphen config slash keys, download cact, hamazer.crt, hamazer.key. Extract the contents of the vpn config.zip to a new folder of your choosing. I extracted mine to a folder called vpn config which is on my desktop. This star.op config file I'm going to choose for this example is, russia.moscow.op. Choose the one that is best for you. For convenience, move your star.op config file to your keys folder. In this case, it's the russia.moscow.op. I am moving. Now we are going to create and edit text files. We need a text editor that is capable of saving text files in Unix file format. In other words, do not use Windows Notepad or WordPad. I would recommend using TextPad or Notepad++. You can download TextPad from here, ftp colon slash slash download.textpad.com slash pub slash textpad 5.4 slash txbank 542.exe. Using TextPad or similar create a new text file and put your username in line 1 and your pass in line 2 and save it as pass.txt. Make sure you choose Unix file format when saving. See screenshot below, put the pass.txt in your keys folder as well. Using TextPad or similar edit your star.op file, in this case, it's the russia.moscow.op. Edit the line off user pass and change it to off user pass slash pass.txt. Also edit the line ca slash key slash cacrt cert slash key slash mazer.crt key slash key slash mazer.key to ca slash cacrt cert slash mazer.crt key slash mazer.key inside your keys folder. You should now have the following files cacrt mazer.crt mazer.key russia.moscow.o or whatever VPN server config you choose pass.txt. Next download WinSCP from here, http colon slash slash wincp.net slash download slash wincp433 setup.exe Launch WinSCP hostname, your router's IP, it's 192.168.1.1 unless you changed it Port number, 22 Username, root Password, your password to your router Private key file, just leave it blank File protocol, SCP Click login, ignore the error about user groups Using WinSCP transfer your, CACRT Mazer.crt Mazer.key Russia.moscow.o Or whatever VPN server config you choose, pass.txt to the slash etc slash open directory of your router. I find it is easiest to just drag and drop while using WinSCP. Now it's time to run the HMA VPN service on the router. We do this by issuing commands via the SSH protocol. I would recommend the SSH client PUTTY. Download PUTTY from here http colon slash slash the dot earth dot li slash tilde sgta tom slash putty slash late slash putty dot exe launch puttty host name your router's ip 192.168.1.1 unless you changed it port 22 connection type ssh click open login as root enter your router's password in the puttty terminal type cd slash etc slash open slash open config russia dot moscow dot o change this to the star dot often you choose your VPN service should now be up and running. You must get the initialization sequence completed message before proceeding. If you didn't get the sequence completed message, you made a mistake while editing your star.op file. Find the mistake and fix it. Test your connection, open the web browser and go to a website. HTTP colon slash slash www.google.com for example. If it works, you're done. If not, please see below. Troubleshooting. If you go to http colon slash slash www.google.com and you get a website not found error, try typing 64.233.169.91 into the address bar instead. If the Google page now comes up, you have a DNS problem. Like I did.
easiest way I have found to fix a DNS problem is to go here, http colon slash slash dios.in slash windows hyphen xp slash free hyphen fast hyphen pub, uberless slash, tip, control plus c to stop VPN or reboot router so you can go to the above public DNS server list address, and select a DNS server from the list. I would recommend you ping each one to find the one that is fastest for you. For this example I will choose the DNS advantage. DNS advantage IP is 156.154.70.1 Go back to your Lucy Web and go to Network Dash Interfaces Click on the Edit button for your VPN, small icon to the far right, from the additional field drop down menu select DNS server click add paste in your DNS server's IP, in this case it's 156.154.70.1 which is DNS advantage. Click save and apply. That should fix any DNS problem. Note, your Lucy Web it might look different than mine. The newest build of OpenRed no longer has the administrator slash essential selections. Also editing the VPN interfaces are slightly different but are similar enough for you to find your way around. Tip, getting this to work can be tedious. Remember to clear your web cache between tries. Control plus C will stop the VPN and open config star dot and will start it. More troubleshooting. If you're still having a hard time try this, with the VPN off, download a legal star dot torrent to your desktop. Just this star dot torrent file, not the torrent itself. It's a tiny file, 30 KB. Start VPN with the open config star dot op command via PUTTY. Once you get sequence completed message, start downloading the actual torrent. Double clicking the star.torrent should start it, open another PUTTY terminal, SSH into your router again, and type ping 8.8.8.8 is it pinging. Go to the Lucy Web dash network dash interfaces is the ton zero interface active. Uptime. How many KB slash MV have been transferred on the ton zero? Do you still have the sequence completed message? Try putting the DNS forward into network dash DCHP and DNS. Example 8.8.8.8, 8.8.8.8 is Google's DNS server, I have had to do this on some builds. Good luck, I'll try to help out with any questions. Thanks to Mouse750 for this tutorial.